Joe, listen. Joe Blow? Or, yeah, Jimmy O from Jimmy Joe Blow. Jimmy Joe Blow? Yep. Well, listen, Joe Blow, Jimmy. Henry was a really nice guy. He was. You, you know, if he liked you, he would kill you fast. <laughs> if he did not like you, you would suffer. So. Well, how you know. did, the, the guy with the TV, I think he, he got it pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> he did get it pretty quick. That's uh, always the funniest. That's always the funniest stuff. Yeah. I I love the crew that James Gunn brings to mm -hmm. his films. Mm -hmm. What is it like? I mean, you guys do so much together. What is it like? What was it like with this film? This film, you know, we've been talking about it. This film is um. This film had a, a, one of the most tight knit casts of any project I've ever worked on. Um, we were, a, a lot of us knew each other already and were, had been close friends for years. Um, and those that didn't, those that were new, um, fit right in and we became friends with. Yeah, yeah. And we hung out, you know, almost every single night after we would, you know, we'd be shooting these intense, uh, horrific scenes. And then we'd go out as a cast and laugh all night and have fun. Nice. Truly. Yeah. I mean, truly, every every day it was, it was spent hanging together after work, you know, so. Yeah. I've got to talk about your character because I love this character because oh, he's such you. a, he's unusual for you. He's a sweet, he's not in it enough, first of all. Yeah. I need more. I want a movie with him. Mm. What was that? You play the nice guy and you have that great relationship with your other janitor. That was awesome. Am I, I mean, I, we were just talking uh, uh, how... Uh, my 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 prime objective when all uh, all goes south is to protect my mentally uh, handicapped uh, challenged uh, co-worker and friend yeah and uh, so I get him try to get him out of the way get him to a safe place and then my second thing is to try to figure out what the hell is going on with this building of mine yeah. I mean how is this possible you know how is it possible you to, you, to use a blow uh, you know a blowtorch uh, and there's no heat from the metal no it's impossible right so I'm very confused and very concerned with that and so that's I don't even get into the you know yeah. to the whole mindset of who am I going to kill you know that kind of thing but you know I maybe you know if 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 other things have happened, it would have happened. Maybe I would have. I'm yeah. not sure. I'm not sure what, what, uh, what Bud would have would have done if a push came to shove. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I don't know. You got a big heart, man. I the loved it. I heart. loved it. Thank you. Thank <laughs> You're you. welcome. And you, of yeah. course. I, do you just write all the fun lines for you? Because those, are, these are great <laughs> lines here. You know, I didn't know which role I was playing when I read the script, so I, I just. I read it and I, I liked Marty a lot from, from the very beginning, um, from the first time I read the script. I, I really like that character. Um, it's something that's sort of different for me yeah. from what I've done in my career, but it's something that I also really felt like I could, I could bring something to it. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a fun, it's a fun one. Awesome. You know, I, I know you say you don't know, but as soon as I read the script, I knew. Maybe so. As soon as you, as soon as I read the script, I knew who you were playing, dude. I absolutely <laughs> knew who you were playing. I came up. We started and it just, shooting. It was and perfectly written for you. Yeah. The, the first day I met McGinley, John C. McGinley, who's a wonderful man, a great actor, but he came in and I told him the role I was playing, and he goes, he goes, that's the best role in the movie on the page, on the page. <laughs> So I'm like, that's a lot of pressure, man. Thanks. <laughs> you lived up to it. You lived up I to it. I appreciate that. <laughs> well, that, and that's, a, again, it's like this, this camaraderie. I love that he said that. Yeah. That's, that's hilarious. I love the camaraderie between you guys. Yeah. The, and this whole group, it's so much fun to watch. And I think you see it. I think there's, you watch it when you're watching the film. You see that. Connection. One thing I'm learning from working with my brother a lot is that, is that hiring people to be part of the cast and the crew as well, but but certainly the, the actors that are working on a movie, it makes a difference to hire people that are actually good people that you, you like spending you know, weeks or months of your time with. Life is way too short. It, exactly. Yeah, yeah. And so hiring like a bunch of people that we know already and that we know are cool and, and, and good to hang out with, but also great at their jobs and take the work seriously, it really helps. It really helps the movie. Oh, you guys are great. Ne yeah. Nepotism is great, but you you know you got to bring them in, and you know they got to do the job. They yeah. they mm -hmm. and you know they will do the job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean you. <laughs> I think there's. I, I think Gunt uh, James says this, uh, all the time that you are the only person that's worked in more projects 
for him than, than I Than you, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, I'm true. second. I'll, <laughs> always, I'll always be second. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys are always first to me. Hey, what's up? You guys are insane for smoking at Belco. They test here. They'll fire you, you know. Quit getting so worked up. Did you even happen to read what you signed when you started working for this place? Terry, where is everybody? All employees, lend me your full attention. There are currently 80 of you in the building. In two hours, we want 30 of you dead. If 30 of you are not dead, we will end 60 of your lives ourselves. We are not going to entertain the option of killing people. My wife and kids need me. themselves.